Hi, I'm State Representative Larry Sequist. It's my privilege to represent the voters, including the students of the 26th Legislative District, which runs from Gig Harbor up to downtown Bremerton, out to Key Peninsula. What I'd like to talk to you for a minute today is about higher education. I chair the House Higher Education Committee, and what I'm on, frankly, is on the war path to encourage all of us Washingtonians to get more educated, and let me show you why. This chart is a map from 20 years ago up through where we are now about unemployment rates. But up here in the red line, it says, if you're a high school graduate, your unemployment rate is through the roof. If you are a college graduate, your unemployment is down around 4%. So there's a huge difference. The more educated you get, the lower the unemployment rate, the more likely it is that you're going to have a good job and career ahead. We Washingtonians are actually, believe it or not, undereducated. We look like we're a higher educated state. We've got Boeing, Microsoft, all of these companies that bring in engineers and highly educated, highly paid people. More than half of those people, however, imported, including from China and Russia and other places. So as chair of higher education, I'm committed to making sure that we Washingtonians are getting more educated. And to do that, I'm gonna walk you through this board here. We're moving a bill now to rearrange the way we deliver education in the state. Our goal is more education, more educated people. We've got a new board that is gonna focus on helping everybody get more educated by keeping the schools focused and by improving our school system. Now we have six universities that get state money. We've got 34 community and technical colleges. We have something north of 300,000 students in those schools. What I'm hoping is that we can begin to manage them much better that we can deliver more students out of those schools. We're gonna need more innovation. So one of the bills I have written, in addition to this one that reorganizes the way we manage our schools, I'm asking the schools themselves to come up with a lot more innovations so that we can get even more students through schools. If you've got ideas about how we can do that, I'd love to hear from you. And again, at the end of this, you'll see the contact data I look forward to talking to you. Remember, we all need to get back to school. Let's see if we can raise our academic credentials, increase our jobs, increase that income, increase our career satisfactions. Thank you very much.